Hey guys, I know you're probably sick of Amazon hauls, and I know that I said in a video yesterday that was actually a couple weeks ago, but the day I'm filming, that video went up yesterday, and I know I said in that video it was gonna be my last one till after Christmas. The reason I said that was because I was really sure that you guys would have voted on Instagram for an Instagram Live Prime Day haul versus a YouTube video, but it was like 93%, like a few hundred votes for a YouTube video versus an Instagram Live. So this is actually your fault, not mine, okay? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So anyway, today I'm gonna show you the educational gifts and things I got on Prime Day. Uh, a couple other things mixed in, but it was mostly, well, I don't know. I think I'm telling myself it was mostly educational stuff, but we'll, we'll take a poll at the end here. Um, Prime Day this year was spread out over the course of two days. And so I tried really hard to pace myself because I was like, sometimes I'll get on Prime Day and I'll be like, like watching lightning deals and I'm like, okay, there's gonna be a lightning deal at 1.05 p.m. for these markers and they're like $11 and the lightning deal will come up and they're like 9.50, which is like $1.50 off and I'm like, yes! And I buy them because the hype. And so I knew that over the course of two days, the deals would probably be better on the second day, which they were, and I didn't want to like spend, spend, spend unnecessarily. I said in a video recently that we're totally changing Christmas this year for our kids and they're only getting a couple or a few gifts each. Um, still working out the details on that, but I didn't need to do shopping really for my kids. Uh, however, like I said on Instagram, you guys are probably really sick of hearing this from me, uh, but I do like to shop uh, in general. I do like to shop, that's all. Uh, but I also like to shop sales and to shop um, what's the word, like intentionally for kids my kids' ages because uh, Salvation Army does the Angel Tree program and this year because of COVID, they normally serve one million children at Christmas time and this year they're expecting a 155% increase. So they're expecting to serve 1.6 million children through their Angel Tree program this year. Because of that, uh, John and I talked and we decided that as a family, we would like to do one child per child uh, that we have. And so we are going to be doing 10 to 12 year old girl, an eight to 10 year old boy, six to eight year old boy, and a little a little one around Annabeth's age. And so, and the only reason we're doing that is because I feel like I have my finger on the pulse of what those kids would want because my kids are in those age brackets. I also plan to take my kids on one-on-one -on -one dates this Christmas to shop for that child. So kind of like, a purposeful Christmas shopping date with each of my kids, if that makes sense. Um, and just pray over the, John and I, before we had the kids, would, we loved, uh, before we had lots of kids, we would just, um, we loved shopping for the Angel Tree kids when our younger ones were really little and really didn't care much about Christmas. And one of my favorite things, my favorite memories ever of Christmas, that if I ever write an entry into Chicken Soup for the Christmas Soul, this would be it, uh, was spreading out the gifts uh, in the piles for each child and walking around and praying over each pile. It sounds so stupid, this is an Amazon haul. Anyway, it really, it really warms my heart to think about doing that now with our kids that they're older because we're not gonna be giving them as much this year. So I just think that, would, that was special. So I like shopping sales, I like shopping deals. I really went into Prime Day focusing on that so that when my kids pick out the things on those kids' wish lists, we can then add a lot of other things and give them a nice Christmas, hopefully, Lord willing. So that being said, Here's what I got. A couple of things will be for my kids and then a couple of the things will be for other kids. And I'm not saying that to be like, to get like pats on the back. I'm saying that in case you guys like to shop like I do, that you can shop, you can shop with a purpose guys. You can shop for Jesus. <laughs> so ridiculous, but I'm, this is my justification. So the first thing is glow in the dark marble run. This is a national geographic deal. This was actually a good deal from what I recall. Uh, so I grabbed this, this may be for Eli, um, but if he doesn't show much interest in things like this, you know, near Christmas time, then that would potentially be for another seven year old boy. I got guests in 10. I thought this was going to be smaller, like stocking stuffer size, but I wanted to add this to our morning basket. So it's, uh, and this is the Animal Planet one where they guess, um, you know, 10, 10 questions kind of, and it gives animal facts on the back. I grabbed two of these, Melissa and Doug. 
uh, was a deal on day two of Prime Day. And I got one for Annabeth and then one for a kid Annie's age. This is like my fourth video that I'm filming today actually, so. Um, and I'm in a rush because my kids are playing outside with John and I don't want them to see any of this. I did grab this as Jesse's logic toy this year, this laser maze game. I grabbed Hi Ho Cherio for um, the Annabeth's age kid. This was just for me, the Julia Rothman collection. I don't have this. I do have food ana anatomy. <laughs> I'm from Chicago, actually. I do have food anatomy um, already, so I might just gift that to someone or give it to Bella because she really likes it. Uh, but I wanted to have the whole set. My, one of my girlfriends is using this in our nature study quite often this year, and it's never looked appealing to me until we've used it this year. This was my what the heck purchase where I got it like there's always one that I buy on a lightning deal that I don't really need I got this pack of three lol dolls and I think it was just like 2019 Christmas memories where I was looking for lol dolls that whole Christmas and so when I saw the deal and it was a good deal when I saw it I like bought it immediately and then I thought about it and I was like wait and we don't do lol dolls in our house anymore and so I was like what do I do? So I tried to cancel it, but it had already shipped or so they say they wouldn't let me cancel it. So I do have these now. I'm not sure what to do with them, but somebody's going to get LOL dolls this year. Um, it's just Bella's not into it anymore. And Annabeth just makes a mess with little things. I grabbed three of these paint by sticker books that for kids, well, I have two of the kids books and one of like the cats ones for Bella because she loves cats. Um, and these were part of the buy two three for the price of two deal that was going on. So I grabbed these um, to put in kids' stockings. Um, so I got the original, and then I think I got Under the Sea, and then the full-size cat one for Bella. Another great deal that I got for the three for the price of two was some five in a row books. So I grabbed the Great Spruce. This was their December mini unit from last year, and this was part of that deal. I also grabbed Balloons over Broadway, which has not arrived yet. It's gonna be here next week and I didn't wanna wait. Um, and something else, uh, that doesn't matter. So I grabbed those two five in a row mini unit books. And uh, there's another thing that's not here yet. It is the Learning Resources, what is it called? The, come on, come on, sorry. Um, the coding critters, the little coding critters. Ranger and Zip. They were the toy of the year last year, ages four and up. So I thought they would be great for um, Bella. So they were, they are $23.79. And on Prime Day, did I just show you my address? Or my zip code? No. On Prime Day, I got it for $11.99. And I wanted those last year, so I'm very excited about it. This I got with a uh, child Bella's age in mind. Um, it's the Rainbow Glitter Glue, great for making slime. Bella's super into slime, so I just had a feeling that she would be buying slime stuff um, when we go shopping. I grabbed Bop It. I have been having, I have had my eye on Bop It. I re just remember it. I miss Bop It. I loved it when I was a kid, and it looks different than it was when I was a kid, but I'm sure it's just as fun. Um, so I grabbed that. I love giving our kids family gifts, which are just different games that they can all open together under the tree. So that's one of those. I grabbed this green toys. I got a couple of green toys on the early prime day deals that I put in my last prime video, but I got this tugboat for the bath for someone. Again, it was just a good deal and I didn't really know who was going to get it, but uh, I wanted to grab it for like a toys for tots or something. This Kitty Zoom watch is for Eli. So this is the third Kitty Zoom watch I will have purchased this year. Bella got one last Christmas. She loves it. She's not too old for it. I mean, it's for four years and up, but she loves it. She takes videos on it. She takes pictures. Jesse wanted one for his birthday this year, so he got a blue one. And then it was a prime day deal this year. I got it for the lowest price I've gotten any of the three of them for for Eli. His birthday is the week of Thanksgiving. So it, he really lucked out with having Prime Day this year. 
And then bird bingo. We are loving bug bingo. My kids seriously love that. We've played it for like the three, the last three or four family game nights in a row and they're not sick of it yet. And so bird bingo was one of the deals. I know this is one that you guys commented on a lot on Facebook telling me that you missed the deal. I was putting deals all throughout the day on there. So um, I know it went really fast and I, I just kind of grabbed it super quick. Uh, I also got some of this. Thank you, Lori, for tipping me off and letting me know that um, that Orgain was on sale. I thought it was just the protein powder, but she sent me a link on Instagram and I grabbed this right away. So this is the, I use this a lot for Annabeth. <laughs> um, this is, this and Z-Bars are her main source of nutrition right now. Um, so I got her the vanilla ones. It was a really good deal. And then for Bella for dance, um, I sent her with these a lot. The um, plant-based or the vegan all-in-one chocolate shake. She loves to stick those in her dance bag on her way to dance. So that's my prime day haul. Like I said, minus those like couple of things that are arriving late, uh, which was just the coating critters and balloons over Broadway. Probably my smallest prime day haul to date. Um, I just feel like I'm learning the ropes of prime day and I'm not buying everything because a lot of the times some, you know, Cyber Monday deals are better. And I also have an awareness of what I'm wanting to buy my kids this year. And, and, and it, that's not a lot of things. And so I tried to like hold myself back a little bit, but let me know in the comments down below what your guys' best Prime Day deal was. I know like a lot of you were telling me if you were looking for tablets, there were some great deals. I know there were some good like Alexa and Echo deals, I think. Uh, which we don't have those in our house, but I was seeing them. Some vacuums, some air fryers. We have a vacuum, but we don't have any of the rest of that stuff here, but I wish we were into it because there were some really great deals that day. Um, and yeah, so let me know what your guys' top deals were. Uh, and if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Sorry for, the, uh, for another Amazon haul. I promise I will not be doing another Amazon haul until way after Christmas now. So you have my word. I will see you guys later. Bye, guys.